Hello, hello, all you beautiful people on Gamer on Grand Street's channel. This is Gophead Fred, and we are going to go ahead and do a little post for post for you, so you will get to see a little bit of my beautiful gameplay with the Shiva, and hopefully you enjoy. But let me go ahead and tell you guys a little bit about myself. I started Call of Duty, and if you couldn't tell already, I'm a Call of Duty channel. I absolutely love Call of Duty, and I pretty much have since I first started out on COD 4. I started off playing with a lot of my friends. We used to just kind of mess around on the uh, multiplayer, just split screen in it. And I didn't even play a lot of multiplayer back when COD 4 came out, but I actually started on COD 4, so I think it's definitely worth a mention to say that uh, I kicked my friends' butts and I had fun. But I really started getting into the scene whenever Modern Warfare 2 came around, and that was my game. I had so much fun in that game, but if you can't tell, I'm pretty much a COD veteran, so I at least I like to think that I am. I, I like to think that I'm pretty decent at the game, and I know a thing or two about it. So, yeah, I, I used to snipe a lot back in like the Modern Warfare 2 days, but obviously, as you can see right here, I'm, I'm not sniping, and I'll go ahead and get to that later but yeah I was a uh, big sniper slash quickscoper whatever you want to call it and I had a lot of fun doing it but um in Black Ops 2 I would say I really had a change of heart when I'm just like man I could just really absolutely wreck people with this assault rifle so I started going with the, with the assault rifle route and I got pretty dang good at the game so I started there and I just honestly kind of worked my way up from there. Um, I'd have to say that World of War was definitely a notable game in my opinion too because the campaign for World of War was absolutely phenomenal. So yeah, I, I've i definitely been playing Call of Duty for a while. I've, you could say that, you know, I'm a pretty big fanboy. And uh, look at this sniper shot. I just got melted, man. Oh, that's crazy. But yeah, um... Call of Duty pretty much has to be one of my go-to games when it comes to gaming in general because, I mean, I, I just absolutely love the feeling of multiplayer. Just being able to absolutely wreck people are... Comple it, it's completely awesome. <laughs> but, yeah. And, honestly, I wouldn't even say that Call of Duty was my first game that got me into the shooter because if any of you guys maybe remember... Back on the PlayStation 2, there was a game called Conflict Desert Storm, and that game was also absolutely phenomenal, especially, like, it. I tried to actually go back and play it not too long ago with my cousin, because he he kind of, he goes with me wherever I go, pretty much. We're, we're pretty much like brothers, me and him, so... Yeah, we, we try to go back through and play on that game a little bit, and it's absolutely insane. The graphics were so bad, and the game played so slow, but that game was so much fun back in the day. Like, it was a PlayStation 2 game, and that's pretty much back when the PlayStation 2, like, wasn't really... It, it, it didn't really have a lot of games yet, so to see a shooter like that was insane, and... Like I said, it, it's it's nowhere near as complex as these games are nowadays. It's it's absolutely crazy where the gaming industry has led us to, and especially like seeing how you can play with all these different people online now is absolutely insane as well. But yeah, I like I said, guys, I started really getting into like uh, as you could say, I guess, pub stomping back in the Black Ops 2 days because I I just really found it amazing that you could absolutely destroy the enemy team and just use all these different streaks against them to have the leg up in the competition and I, I, I don't know is this like I said there's just something it's a really good feeling knowing that you can go against somebody else and call on all these crazy streaks and like you'll see my raps right here it, it, it just feels so satisfying to know that <laughs> you're pretty much the reason the enemy team is hurting right now but yeah, enough about my background. Let me go ahead and tell you a little bit more about me and who I am. I consider myself a family gamer because I have a beautiful, 
beautiful fiance and a daughter and it, they're pretty much my pride and joy. I have a full-time job so as you as you guys can tell I'm, I'm a little bit busy in my life but I try to upload often. I like to say that I like to say you know save a little bit of time for fun and games so don't expect to see you know daily content for me but definitely expect to see me upload often if that makes sense to you guys because I don't want I don't want to you know sit here and lie to you guys like oh yeah come check my channel for awesome content daily and you know obviously I don't want to lie to you guys but I do put out content I try to do it like every few days so I'd say that it's definitely worth a look if you want to check out any more of my content and I like to use a variety of guns as well like of course I go more toward the SMG and assault rifle side of things but I, I like to switch it up pretty much every game so you'll be able to see me upload a big variety of content because well besides the game type I really like playing team deathmatch for some reason in this game but I am very open to my like any kind of game type suggestions so I mean I, I do upload a lot of team deathmatch right now but possibly expect to see me upload some like domination or kill confirmed in the future because I actually really like those games as well so I try not to be too limited on the con type of content that I make but I do like to obviously play what I enjoy so I've been I've just enjoyed a lot of team deathmatch in this game but like I said I'm not going to limit it just to team deathmatch so yeah I just started making videos a couple months ago in it's it's treating me pretty well. I've I've definitely had a pretty good time. I've met some cool people like Gamer on Grand Street. He's he's a pretty cool dude. So I have we actually met off of a freedom forum. And if you guys are starting a channel or anything, and ever need to figure out any way to go to maybe grow your channel or try to network yourself, I would definitely suggest Freedom. Freedom is a very nice place to go. Or like even any other sub networks. They have a lot of sub networks and stuff like that. But it's definitely worth taking a look and investing some of your time in that because like I said that's where we went and it, it's worked out pretty well for us but yeah let's go ahead and talk about some of my goals my goals for my channel are to strive for a more positive community I want to entertain first and foremost obviously and don't mind these silly deaths right here because I was I was wanting that 50 bomb so bad but I just <laughs> I got melted, but yeah, I'm I'm definitely straying for a more positive outlook on the community. So that's just a little bit about me, guys. I really hope that you enjoyed my commentary, and if you guys would like, definitely I would suggest come check out my channel and sub me. Just you know, swing by and say what's up. I hope to see you guys there, and you guys stay awesome. Go pet out.